everyone, today I'm going to show you a quick tutorial on how to make stickers in Procreate. Okay, so this is my sticker sheet. I made my canvas eight and a half by 11 inches, so I highly recommend you do the same for your sticker sheet, or if you want a specific custom size, you can do that. But this is what I'm working with today. So ideally, I would have all of my stickers filled in, but for the sake of time, we're just going to pretend that my sticker sheet is completely filled in and that we are almost done and almost ready to put into our cutting machine. Okay, so at this point, you have your sticker sheet completely filled in with all of your sticker illustrations. So we're gonna go to layers and then we're gonna hide the background color because we do not want that. Now you're gonna see that I've already started drawing some of my white borders you're going to need to draw a white border behind every single one of your illustrations. So when you put it into your cutting machine, it will know to cut around that white border. Okay, so what you're going to do to make your white borders is create a new layer. So go to the plus sign, and this will be your white border layer. I already have one here, so that's what I'm gonna use. Now go to your brush library and make sure you're on a monoline brush. This is going to make the border process really simple for you, so make sure you do that. And then make sure that you are on the color white. Okay, so we're gonna start with this radish right here. So let's adjust the brush size just a little bit. And then you're just going to go around the illustration and make as concise of a border as you can. Because if your border is too wobbly, your um, your cutting machine is not going to be happy with you. There we go. Let's see how that looks. Pretty good. Okay, now what I want you to do after every single one of your stickers is I want you to go to your layers panel. I want you to turn your illustrations off and make sure that there isn't any space left in the back that isn't filled in. Okay. Now we are good to go. I probably should make this a little bit smaller of a border. Hold on, freehand. So let me edit. Let me make it just a smidge smaller because I just feel like it's too big compared to the other borders. There we go, much better. Okay, so now what we are going to do is keep that background transparent. We are going to want it to be transparent all the way up until export. Okay, so let's say you're ready to export all of your stickers. Go to the settings panel then go to PNG. Now you have to export it as a PNG because a PNG keeps that transparent background. If you export it as anything else, your background will be white and things won't work out right. Okay, so export it as a PNG and save it to your camera roll. If your Cricut cutting apps are on your iPad or save it as an airdrop and airdrop it into your desktop to wherever your design cutting apps are there. Either way, you can do whatever you want. And then from there, pull it into your design studio and you are all set to start cutting. And that's it. Thanks so much for watching.